And today we are going to eat Chipotle. Chipotle, Chipotle, Chipotle. I don't think I've ever done a mukbang with Chipotle. This is what I get. I get the burrito bowl. You gotta have it. Anybody who ain't had the burrito bowl, you gotta have it. If he's slapping. I've had their burritos. I ain't gonna lie. I've had their burritos. Their burritos be um, slapping too, but they ain't slapping like a burrito bowl is. But this is what I usually get. I got queso, guac, sour cream, cheese, uh, brown rice, chicken, and... Oh, did I say pico? Pico, sour cream, um, and um, veggies. That's all I get on there. I mean, it ain't, it ain't nothing big. It ain't nothing like that. It's, 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 it's still good. So, we just gonna leave it like that. I'm gonna give me some taco sauce because they don't put enough sauce in here. That's one thing I will say. Not just about Chipotle, but all these fast food places or restaurants, they be stingy about their food. They don't want to give you a lot of food. They fill your ass up then. Haven't y'all noticed that? It's like out of, like, you can't, you go anywhere, they get stingier and stingier with the food. The fuck? I don't know what's up with that. I don't know if they low on food or what, but they be as stingy as a motherfucker. Or probably because them, um, them, um, them employees are eating it. I guarantee you. Because in Wendy's, I went to Wendy's and them motherfuckers was eating that shit. Oh, by the way. Let me do a um, thumbnail. Yeah! Okay, that's enough. Wait. All right, that's enough. If you got it, you got it. If you don't, hey, it is what it is. <laughs> I'm hungry, so I'm ready to eat. Oh, the share of blessings. We got to say blessing. I got to do better at that. Lord, let us thank you for the food that we are about to receive for the nourishment of our bodies for Christ's sakes. Amen. God is good all the time. Are they see? Watch. Watch when, I'm, watch when I take a bite of this. Mm. Oh, my God. I just went to heaven, y'all. I just went to heaven. I'm going to heaven anyway, but I just went to heaven right just like that. I'm telling you. It's the guac for me. It's the guac. Their guacamole is fresh as fuck. And I like the guacamole fresh, so. Oh, my God. Not everybody's guacamole is fresh and good like that, but this. I think. When they get rid of that, that's where I'm going to have a little bit of a problem with Chipotle. Because their guacamole is just... Deliciosos! Mmm. Mmm. You think so, Cali? No, you don't know. You don't eat it. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. And I hope you guys enjoyed the challenge I did yesterday. I don't think it's a challenge, but it's more so like rating. Is that considered a challenge? Either way, hey. It was a, it was a Tuesday challenge video, so it is what it is. But um, hope y'all enjoyed it, because that took me almost the whole day. Well, I'm not going to say the whole day, but it was mainly it's mainly downloading for my GoPro. Because I have an app on my Go, for my GoPro where I have to transfer... The videos that I make on there to my phone so I can do my editing on my phone. I'm still trying to work on the editing on my computer so I can eventually do that. But I do not want to use my GoPro as much anymore. Which is 
the only time I really would use it is if I'm doing like screenshot videos like that, like screen records on my phone like that. Right now I'm recording on my phone, so it's like, mm. it's just, it just be hard, and then it and then it stops. I have to I have to check it every like two or three minutes during the video. I have to get up and check to make sure it it, it don't stop because it doesn't have like a blinking like. You know that red blinking when it's on the camera, stuff like that. It doesn't show the front, and it doesn't show you, like it. You can like right now. I can see me because my camera. It's not facing my camera. I got it where it's showing me, but it doesn't do that on my GoPro, which makes it very difficult. Because I don't know if it's still recording or not, and the screen turns off, but it's still recording. So I don't know if the lighting's good or what. That's one thing I hated about it. Listen. I didn't. I didn't want the GoPro. I really didn't. I did. I did not buy the GoPro. It was my folks that bought that GoPro for me. I wanted a regular camera. Apparently, they don't know the difference when it comes to vlogging. They don't know the difference between a good camera and a bad camera. And GoPro, they say GoPro is good to vlog with. I disagree. I disagree. I disagree. That was no. That was the. That was the most worst. Like this is the worst investment. I have made well. I didn't make the investment, but it's just no. It's just this is it's bad. It's bad. It's bad. It's bad. It's bad. As I and I hate it because when it stops, it it makes it fucks up my video because I want it to be all where I'm not having to get up and all that. I can just sit here, and boom, boom, boom. But for that, it stops and it pisses me off because then that fucks up my editing and I have to redo. The, sh the scene, I have to redo it and re react to it, and it just ain't the same. And I don't like that. So, that's why I'm trying to put as much hours as I can at work so that I can eventually afford it. Because it costs like 400 for like the whole kit for a can. I kind of want to get a Canon camera. I think it's called Canon. I want to get. I want. I'm leaning more towards that because I hear it's got best quality and all that. But I still have to do my research because I want the best quality. I don't. I you know. Whatever. In, in a way, I want a camera that got the best quiet, the best quality, best lighting. Ain't gonna stop on me. Can show my face. This got a camera that can show me. That's that's got a blinking that knows that if it's recording or not. And if it stops recording, I know right away. You know, just those type of features. Not the features that don't come with that. But enough of that. I got some good news. We hit 200 something. Um, I think on Sunday. We hit 200 subscribers. So let's keep them subs going up. Let's keep them subs going up. Appreciate y'all. Showing some love. I appreciate you. Y'all can watch me. But y'all, some of y'all be watching and not subscribing. It's like what the fuck is up with that? Are you gonna watch me and not subscribe? Why, what, 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 what's up with that? You come here every week. You watch me. You don't like. You don't comment. You don't post the notifications. And you don't sub. The fuck? Just like with TikTok. You motherfuckers be on my, be viewing my profiles and shit, but y'all don't wanna sub. I mean, y'all don't wanna follow. The fuck's up with that? Where's the law of that? That's cool, though. That's cool.
<laughs> I just noticed it got so fucking quiet. I might as well have a cricket or something in here. Oh, that's why, because the bit, what's the name's off? Because we still gotta get that shit fixed. We still gotta get that fixed because, um, it's like rattling. Like, it's rattling. Like, da -da 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 on it. We don't even have it on. We have our, um, fans going and shit like that. Because I turned it on yesterday and she was like, why'd you turn it on? I'm like, it's fucking hot in here. Cause it be hot. Like right now it's a little getting, it's already starting to get a little hot. It ain't like it's got no fan up in this kitchen. Why the hell does kitchens not have fans? Why are there not fans in the kitchen? Am I the only one that wonders that? Why aren't there fans in the kitchen or the dining room? Or Dens. Well, there are some dens, but this one don't. Why? Somebody answer that question to me. Why the fuck aren't there fans in the kitchen? Because you can get hot in the fan. You can get hot in the kitchen too. The hell you build a big old. The hell you big a house. Build a house with no fan in the kitchen. Mm. Mm. You want to know one thing about mukbang is, is that um, I watch I watch these mukbang videos. You notice some of these mukbang people that eat all the time? You see them when they first made their videos of how they were skinny and everything, kind of like me. And then you look at them like now. And oh yeah, those videos that I watched, they, the, um, when they first started, they were like in back in like 2014, no, 2015, 2016. And then now they're like big and all that shit. You notice that? I noticed that with that one mukbang, what's his name, Nick Natale, Natale, somebody, that motherfucker's weird and crazy, if you ask me, I, don't, I think the food has fucked him up, because he was sane when he, when he first started, he was sane, but now, he's fucking weird, he's just fucking, just, he lost it, like that food got to his head or some shit. It's like, put down the burgers, put down the pizzas. Step away from the burgers and the pizzas. Two hands back. Step away from pizza. I'm stupid, y'all. <laughs> Maybe people can't walk back. <laughs> All right, let me stop, let me stop, let me stop. Let somebody get in their feelings. Mm. I still got famous Dave's in there, but I was like, I'm gonna eat that for dinner. I'm gonna eat something else for my bang.
because we eat out every day. We eat out every day. If it's not lunch, it's dinner. We eat out every day. I try to eat at home for lunch um, and then grab some for dinner because we have it now where it's like I try to text them ahead of time of what I want. So that she could pick it up and we don't gotta wait until I get off. I sometimes I get off at 8. I've been getting off at 9. Well, I've been getting off at 8.30 now because now that I found out that I ain't gotta stay late. So I've been getting off at 8.30, but still. I don't wanna wait late like that to get something to eat unless it's to Taco Bell or some shit like that. But um, on the forefront, we eat out every day. We eat out every day. We don't really cook at home like that. We never really cooked at home like that. At least for. Me and my mom's like I didn't like my mom didn't cook all the time like that. She we always ate out or ate some motherfucking hot pot. I grew up off of hot pockets, spaghetti and hot links. Well, Chef already spaghetti, but I put the hot link in it. You know, don't look at me like that because some of y'all y'all some of y'all like y'all hot dogs and y'all spaghetti or, or hot links. I mean, that's just me. I still eat hot links with my spaghetti until this day. So, um, that and, um, the chimichanga, like, burrito packets, I eat those, um, um, TV dinners. We grew up off of stuff like that. We didn't really, my mom didn't really cook like that, because she worked. She worked. She wasn't no stay-at-home mom. She was a single parent. She had to work, so, hey, you gotta do what you gotta do. Either way, we ate. Either way, either way, we didn't miss we didn't miss a meal. That's all that matters. Whether you're eating out or you're eating at home all the time, either way, you're eating and you're not missing a meal. That's what the only thing that matters is that you're not missing a meal. That's all that matters. It don't matter how you get it or it's, the bottom line is you're eating. Mm. Mm. Yeah, I like to scrape I like to scrape up I like to scrape it in a corner so I can get all of it. I don't like to miss anything. I like to eat it all. Hell, it's a surprise I ain't fat as much as I eat. Mm. You think I'd be in a 200s? Shit, I can't even get past the hundreds. <laughs> I'm still like in a hundred something. Or less, shit. I can't even get past this. Probably when I get older, I might, boom, I might have a gut or something. What's going on, y'all? It's about a mile here. Back again for another banger. Motherfucking banger. I, I'll, be, I'll be that old man rubbing the belly and shit like that. Where well, are they gonna be ready? I'm done, y'all. I'm done. <laughs> That's all y'all get from me today. I'm done. Mmm. Mmm. That's all of it. I ate all of it. I told you I wasn't gonna miss it. I don't miss a meal. Fuck that hurt. Why the hell did I just do that? Ah oh, shit, I'm stupid. That fucking hurt! Shit! Anywho. I think that pretty much wraps up um, the mutt bang. I don't really have much to talk about. I, don't, I gotta find more stuff to talk about when I'm doing these type of videos. I'll work on it. I mean, I, used, I usually got it together, but lately I haven't had much to talk about because there really ain't shit much going on. All I'm doing is just still moving boxes and shit, getting ready to move, working, uh, 
entertaining with y'all. Um, TikToks. I got to start um, doing that on Facebook. Um, I think I will try to do a Twitch live stream soon. I really, I really want to do a gaming one, but I don't have the set to do it with. And I'm still trying to work on getting that PS5, so it's like... It's always busy, busy, busy. It's always, I always got something going on. I just want to be in a place where I ain't got shit going on. And I could just, everything could be where I need it to be. And I have everything I need. I still got shit I need to get and need to buy. But I can't afford it right now. So it's like, ah! Because you want the shit now. But, hey, patience is a virtue. I guess that's what they say. But sometimes, it takes too long. But, either way, I'm gone, y'all. As always, what I need y'all to do is I need y'all to like, I need y'all to comment, I need y'all to subscribe. Hit that bell for notification for all the motherfucking babies, and I shall see you in the next, I said in the next video. This is nigga.